<laughs> and welcome to the world of All Star Discs. Now, this is your chance to take home a slice of pop memorabilia. My name is Derek Marks, and this is my TV wife, Emma Redmond. Nice yes. to be back with you. I haven't watched you for so long. Too long. And I tell you what, how exciting to be surrounded by a room full of goldenness. And it's all about stepping back in time yeah. with pop legends. And they are the biggest legends, we aren't they? We have got a show full of legends. I'm not just talking about Derek Marks either, by the way. <laughs> uh, but we're on the red carpet. We have got some amazing, amazing slices of music legendary for you to take away today. So you've got the likes of Oasis. We have got David Bowie. We've got oh well, just Prince in this show in there as well. We've got just in Cher this... in there as well. Can Love you believe it? it? <laughs> oh, it's going to be absolutely brilliant. Now let's tell you a bit more about All Star Discs. They are completely and utterly limited edition mm -hmm. and collectible. We've got some of the very, very best pricing we can possibly do on some of the biggest, most iconic artists and albums that there are in the world. You know when you're looking for that something, for that someone that has everything, mm -hmm. then this is the ultimate gift. Now this gives you the chance as well, doesn't it, to feel like you're a, a legend yourself and get that brilliant gold disc feeling. Yeah, it's great this. as well. We've got a couple of options too. We've got the gold disc, but we've also got the CDs displays as well. And I think these are so good for places that you just want to kind of sit and enjoy music. So maybe you've got a home office perhaps. Um, imagine when, in fact, we've been out before, Planet Hollywood. You've got yeah. Hard Rock Cafe, you've got memorabilia mm -hmm. all along the wall. In fact, this is a great way to maybe start a collection, especially if you are a huge music fan. You can start a collection of these discs and they are brilliant. They're a good size as well, which is great. They're 16 by 20 inches, so they're a great size. And of course, we want to tell you, it is free P and P, which is great. Yeah, which is really, really good. Now, make sure you have a look on the website as well. It's allstardiscs.tv mm. because if you've got someone in your life that is absolutely crazy on Bowie, The Stones, Cliff Richard, Cher, whoever it may be in the music world, you are going to find them on our website. And do remember that they are all limited edition. How impressive to have this in your life framed and mounted for you. So it really is the full deal, isn't it? Yeah, I it's love great. this. It's and such a good idea. As well, you know, if you're not great at DIY, they've got, I quite like DIY. This is why I've kind of pick this bit out they've got the best hook on the back as well it's already done there for you yeah. it's literally nailing and boom you can pop it on the wall make sure you get that little bubble the spirit level as well to make sure if you are buying a few they're all nice and straight oh it is going to be a collection of legends isn't it because mm. we all have we all have those memories don't we of particular icons that maybe you followed throughout their career it could mm. be a group it could be a you know a, a solo artist whoever it is we've all got those We've all got those moments and they all mean something to us because music's so important, isn't it? Mm. So let's get started, shall we? And um, let's start with one of the ultimate legends, shall we? Mr. Bowie himself. My uncle, my uncle Alan is absolutely Bowie crazy, let me tell you. He's got guitars, he used to dress like him when he was going through the Ziggy Stardust. Yes, of course. I think a lot of people do go for that kind of look when it comes to fancy dress parties, don't they? But this is Heroes, and it's a 12 studio album by David Bowie. It was released in 1977, RCA Records, and it is just brilliant. You've got Heroes on there, of course, which is an amazing track, but also Beauty and the Beast. I did not know that he was involved uh, with the track Beauty and the Beast, which is just amazing. Really? Um, and of course, Heroes is one of Bowie's best known and acclaimed songs, I think, isn't it? And like you say, when it comes to music, I think, all of us, when we hear a certain song, it kind of takes us back to a certain memory, whether it's a certain place, it's maybe people who you were with, it's maybe going to on a particular holiday. So to kind of have a piece um, of this and have Bowie on your wall, it just kind of like triggers that memory, I think, to, you know, a happy place. Yeah, completely. And, and there will be, I mean, if you look through the track list on the album as well, there'll be songs that you instantly recognise. I mean, if you've got someone that's absolutely Bowie crazy in your life right now, um, I'm thinking it's more likely to be uh, a gent because he was less of a kind of sex symbol and more of an icon, really, Bowie, For wasn't sure. he? Sure, yeah. 
Yeah, definitely. Not to say that it wasn't a good looking fella, but... Well, no, I tell you what, that jawline as well. <laughs> He's got a great jawline. Was it Labyrinth that he was in as well? Was that the yes, film I, back yes, in the day? Yes, it was, yeah. Uh, that was just brilliant. I mean, very, very clever as well because the tracks were actually composed on the spot in the studio, but the lyrics weren't actually written by David until he literally stood in front of the microphone. Really? Yeah, it literally just kind of came to him. It was just brilliant. Remember, these are limited edition as well. So the number that you get will be the only number in the world and throughout the world and literally once they're gone they are gone there is 150 and they're not going to be remade either so it's kind of quite nice as well just to have that little piece of exclusivity who doesn't want that it is a, a superb exclusive piece of pop history for you to take home and if you want this one the ultimate bowie collectible isn't it and actually there have been a lot of collectibles uh, of david bowie um, and his life and music over the years so this is something new maybe you've got someone who's got a little bit of a bowie collection maybe they've got all of the albums maybe they've got a poster maybe they've got something else and you're just looking to just top up that collection what an exclusive way to do it now remember this is a massively reduced price tag as well so we're looking at under 200 pounds for a slice of pop history with david bowie now all you need to do is go to the website at allstardiscs.tv you can pop in that item number straight away it's 2236 it's 199.99 the postage is absolutely free of all charge which is brilliant and don't forget also you can spread the cost of that over interest-free payments as well um, and I just think a lot of us at the moment, we don't have that opportunity to go out and peruse and to look and often actually things like this, collectible memorabilia items, often they're in auctions, aren't they? So often you're competing for price against other people. And of course, that price then ends up going up and up and up, doesn't it? So I think this is really, really lovely. It's a tangible, it looks fantastic. I mean, to have that gold disc kind of experience mm. up there in your home somewhere. As I say, we were talking earlier, it might be a home office, it might be a man cave, do you know what I mean? It's, I think it's <laughs> Or a woman brilliant. cave. <laughs> oh, that's true, yeah, yeah. yeah. Man cave, woman cave. Uh, next up, we are talking, it's a Kind of magic. magic. Yes. We are on to Queen, a kind of magic. And I have to say, it really stands out nice. You've got the same format again, as you can see. You've got the gold there, which really makes a difference as well, depending on the lights and depending where you do have this in your home. Yes, yeah, gorgeous. You'll have a definite, you'll probably buy a spotlight just for this, I won't think you? So. To shine down over it. Why not? Maybe you kind of got a little bar in your house or, you know, a little bit of an area where you like to do a bit of karaoke, you know when people can get together and have a bit of a party. It's just great to be able to kind of adorn your walls with these types of things. Of course, you've got the album cover on there as well. And remember, it is exclusive as well. So remember, if you do have a, a kind of magic, you have got the album, One Vision is on there, Friends Will Be Friends, Who Wants to Live Forever. Oh, um, love and that it song. has actually been voted one of the greatest albums of all time as well, which is just great. Uh, the film uh, was Highlander. Um, that the album is based on, the soundtrack to the film Highlander. I have to say, you know, a lot of the research that's been done here, it's kind of great to kind of, you know, have a bit of a delve it's into good it all. To learn, it's good to learn things that you never knew, because often yeah. when you think of Queen, you think of Brian May and his big hair, yes. uh, and, and you think of the absolute genius that was the late, great Freddie Mercury. Yeah. Like, uh, and, and you think, and, and Freddie Mercury's music I think penetrates so many of us and our lives and moments in our lives. We can all think, anyone of a certain age um, will think straight away of his performance on Live Aid, yeah. which was, oh, you know, it really, it makes your spine tingle just yeah. thinking about it. I just think Yellow Jacket. Do yeah. you? Yeah, yeah. Every time. And, you know, and the microphone without the bottom of the stand. Yes, of course. Yeah, all of that, isn't it? So rock and roll. So rock and roll. Um, I think as well, what I love about it is to be able to have a, a slice of this and to have this on your wall. Maybe you've been to one of their concerts before back in the day. Yeah. And it's just, again, a nice little bit of a memory. And it's just going to make a great present for any Queen fan for sure. It's awesome. What an opportunity for you to take, again, that little slice of history, all the memories that go with it as well, and all of those iconic, iconic songs. Here's how you get yours. 
Log on now to allstardiscs.tv to grab yourself a piece of authentic music memorabilia. For that special on-screen price, you'll receive an exclusive framed and mounted presentation display that will look fabulous in any home, office or business. Order today and you'll enjoy free UK P&P, saving $9.99. Plus, you can choose to spread the cost of your purchase over six interest-free payments. So, don't miss out. Each release is limited to only 150 pieces worldwide. And when they've gone, they've gone. Order yours now at allstardiscs.tv. Oh, Easy. awesome. Awesome, awesome. What an, an amazing gift. And, and I know you're probably thinking about the people in your life right now. Could be birthdays, could be anniversaries, could be any reason right now do you know what i mean it's Just really lovely on the face. yes absolutely mm. and if you know there's a particular artist that someone's crazy over then go for it right now it's a really nice limited edition as well should we have a look at some of the other artists that we've got on offer as well yeah we've got prince purple rain of course which is brilliant i mean this album was great i always loved when doves cry because that was in romeo and juliet the film back in the day ah. uh with leonardo dicaprio and claire danes right that's a good film to watch yeah. actually if you fancy that uh released on uh 25th of june 1984 warner brothers records i just love 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 prince he was just very much kind of one of his own wasn't he just kind of like you know rule breaker no holds Completely. barred this is me this is what i do like it a lump it we've also got george michael oh, for gosh. you too this is amazing it's the third album by george michael this is from 1996 virgin and aegean records and if you remember there was um, i can't make you love me star people 97 it was just amazing also um he was voted british best male at the mtv europe awards and the brits he's had an ivan novello award of course just an amazing guy and then we've also got frank sinatra i tell you what i see that album cover and i just think let's just sit back and chill yeah yeah. <laughs> and of course, Nice and Easy is the name of this uh, um, album. Capitol Records from 1960. You've got Nice and Easy on there, the old feeling. Nice Fools easy. rushing and how deep is the ocean? Just brilliant. These are great. Incredible. All of those available on the website and many more legends as well on allstardiscs.tv. They are incredible. Remember that they are all limited edition as well. So when these limited editions do sell out, they will not be repeated in the same format ever again. So mm. it's a really, really good opportunity for you to get that limited edition slice of, it is pop history, isn't it? When yeah. you're talking about uh, people like, I mean, George Michael, you, you hear a lot about, don't you? Mm. And we're hearing more and more and more now, again, sadly, after his passing as well, about the amazing good work that he did, very quietly in the background and whatever. And Frank Sinatra, I mean, he could sing you your shopping list, couldn't he? <laughs> and it would it would I just like sound that. wonderful, yeah. wouldn't it? You know, there wasn't you never thought, okay, it all sounds the same, you know, I'm getting bored of it. No, absolutely not. It's brilliant. Mm. It's wonderful. And I think actually everyone has a special connection and their own memories and their own associations with legends which is brilliant and talking of legends oh yes here we go this is elton john now this is a slightly different format that we've got now this is the cd and also the pictures which just looks brilliant so something a little bit different now these have got a silver frame around them they're the same size as well so they are 16 inches by 20 inches and the photo display i just think it looks really really classy yeah, he's lovely. got some all right shades on there as well he can usually go a little bit wacky <laughs> <laughs> with, his, uh, with his eyewear. He can get away with anything, can uh, Yeah, album. to be fair. He, yeah, he can This is do. a great album, though, track-wise. Mm. I was just looking through the um, the listing. So, um, Candle in the Wind. Love so, it would that. have been, I, I guessing, uh, this would have been the original version, wouldn't yeah. it? Yeah. Uh, because, of course, then he did a, a, a different version, didn't he, for um, Diana's. For Diana. Yeah, yeah. of course. Yeah, this absolutely. album's from 1995. Um, it's got his own record label. I'm not surprised Did at you? all. I think he's got his own everything, hasn't he? Yeah, yeah, and you know what? True. You know when you, you think, actually, Elton John is, is, you know, absolutely stinking filthy rich, which I think is amazing. And you know when you think sometimes you resent it with some people? Mm. With Elton John, you think, you know what? You've worked for every penny and pound of that. Over how many decades now has he been in the music business? Well, this went platinum in 11 countries and multi-platinum in seven countries. I'm not surprised. So he deserves every single he's penny. He's loved around the world. You know what? He does he does work i know listen he'll travel in the best of style they'll probably have oh, his yeah. own planes and everything else but you know what he goes around the world 
and he puts on a show. Mm. Even even to this day, do you know what I mean? A true entertainer. Yes. That's what he is. And a grafter yeah. as well. A real hard working grafter. And actually he does an awful lot to support the, the next generation um, of artists as well. I mean he's he's on the phone and in the background giving advice to new artists who are breaking through right now mm. even right now and he's been there as a pillar of support for you know some pop stars over the years have kind of lost their way in one way or the other and elton john seems and elton john's had his moments as well do you know what i mean it, it, which is well documented but he's helped so many people through so many kind of phases of their life as well now this is brilliant. So this is the mounted CD and the photo. And you can see um, the price tags for this option um, are different to the gold disc option. So again, it gives you, it might just be that you choose a gold disc option and a CD option for the same artist as well. Go and have a peruse around the website. So there are 129.99. If you want this one, which is Elton John's Love Songs, that's the item number you need, 2942. Remember, it is free postage and packaging. So that if there are several items that you want you're not building up and racking up any postage and packing and you can split the cost of these highly collectible items as well um, you can spread the cost interest free and all the details are there for you on the screen which is brilliant I'm loving this because I, I just love talking about icons I love talking about icons that I know but I love the fact that we're learning so much about other mm. pop stars that you, you know you don't necessarily know now my first memory of Cher was um, hearing a track from the 70s, and I was born in the 70s, so I was in the pram most of the 70s, um, but I remember <laughs> the first song I, I remember hearing from Cher was Gypsies, Tramps and Thieves, which is something like the middle of the 70s, I think it was, so just after the Sonny and Cher days. Oh, okay. But, and then, of course, like she really came... I guess for people of our age, she really came to the fore probably in the 90s where she got all funky and sparkly and vocoder, she, uh, vocoder like with believe and whatever. Yeah, and didn't she do the whole robotic kind of Yeah, that's vocoder. Voice? Is that's, that what it is? That's vocoder, where, that's where yeah. you sing into a microphone and it changes it into sort of yes. computery like sound. Yeah, well, this album is brilliant, released in 1999. If I Could Turn Back Time was on there. Believe, the Shoop Shoop song, Walking in Memphis. Oh, Shoop Shoop song. I Got You, babe. So iconic. You know what? If he could, he'd probably stand up and start dancing oh, right I so now. Would. Over three million <laughs> copies were sold uh, worldwide. Gosh. I tell you what, looking at that, she hasn't aged a day either. She's I think amazing. She has help, but she it's looks probably fair good. to say she has. She can afford the right cream. Do you know <laughs> what I mean? Can. We'll go as far as saying that. You know, just in case the lawyers are watching. Yeah. But <laughs> isn't she again she's a grafter as well isn't she she's come from absolutely nowhere um and her story if you've ever followed her story uh, uh, about how she actually came into the music business as well that really is completely and utterly fascinating her love affair with um sonny bono as well mm. uh, which is again it is brilliant it's quite heartwarming that this is the album that has so many of those iconic songs on it as well so that makes this just that a little bit more special doesn't it, it does and you know what the outfits and the wigs oh wild the hair i just think again amazing somebody else well i think all of these legends who we kind of see on these shows are ones who you would want to go to a fancy dress party dressed as yeah. do you know what i mean and yeah. instantly recognizable um as well so you're looking here at the uh, photo display and the cd they are limited edition remember only 150 in the world so once they are gone they are gone and the number that you get out of that 150 is the only one which is just brilliant so you've got a true piece of music memorabilia here oh i love share and how special does that feel i mean i would love that um, you know, if you're coming up to a birthday or, you know, at the moment we just can't go out, can we, and, and peruse through items that we want to buy. And at the end of the day, because, you know, we have the same shops in, in different places right the way around the country, it's really, really difficult to find that kind of needle in a haystack for someone. Well, here is your chance to they take that slice of pop legends from around the world. Log on now to allstardiscs.tv to grab yourself a piece of authentic music memorabilia. For that special on-screen price, you'll receive an exclusive framed and mounted presentation display that will look fabulous in any home, office or business. Order today and you'll enjoy free UK p, &P saving $9.99. Plus, you can choose to spread the cost of your purchase over six interest-free payments. 
So don't miss out. Each release is limited to only 150 pieces worldwide. And when they've gone, they've gone. Order yours now at allstardiscs.tv. Do you know what? This is so, so lovely because it, it, it's wonderful because, you know, everyone, I'm sure, has their own memory. So as we're talking about the different things that we remember, mm. you probably have, you know, maybe you went to a concert. Maybe you've still got the ticket from a, an iconic concert. I was just thinking, actually, this is a really lovely opportunity because this is like our alternative right now rather than flying to Vegas and getting a ticket to go and see that legend right now, which, yeah. you know, difficult to do right now. Yeah. So this is something that's far more permanent and far more long lasting than that, isn't it? Yeah, because normally you would probably save that ticket, maybe get it framed yeah, forever. with a little photo yeah. and of course, you know, then buy the CD. But, but these add to your collection you. so beautifully, don't they? Mm. I mean, I, I think that's the thing about this is that everyone has their group. So even if you're a couple that have been together for, you know, 30, 40, 50 years, you've got your group they've got their group like it's yeah. so personal music isn't it oh yeah it is now next up we've got the rolling stones and this is sticky fingers can i say i just love the name of the album sticky fingers i mean who even thinks about all these yeah, things yeah we, we don't want to know how it came no about. we don't now the artwork <laughs> is andy warhol you can probably imagine it's Gosh. a little bit out there very very innovative and you know what i love about these as well it is that you may have heard these songs playing throughout your home on vinyl with your parents playing them or your grandparents yeah. playing them. Yeah. So what a lovely gift to kind of send them to say, I remember dancing around in my nappy, you know, when you used to be playing this. And it's just the memories that this kind of brings up for a lot of people. Can so you imagine um, commissioning the equivalent of Andy Warhol today to design your album cover? And, you know, I mean, who would you commission right now? It would be one of the famous artists, wouldn't it, right now? A well, Banksy, I suppose, wouldn't yes. you? You would ask to design your album cover right now. And we don't know how to get in touch with him. So let, <laughs> let, let's let's think of a designer that's kind of more accessible that we could go to right now. Who would you think, like, current right now? Who's the guy that puts, um, puts bits of cows in formaldehyde? <laughs> Pardon? Stephen, oh, what's his name? You know the one, Damien Hurst. Right, so if we oh, ask Damien Hurst okay. to design an album cover right now, how yeah. much, how many thousands, tens of thousands, hundreds of well, thousands you would could need, that commission be? You would need the Rolling Stones bank account, I think, to be able to afford something like that. But just awesome. Like, that's two iconic, you know, Andy Warhol, the Rolling Stones, two massive icons. Coming together. Yeah. Definitely. Remember, these are limited edition as well. Good size, which is fantastic. And this could be the start of maybe a collection that you want to start. So it might be that you want to treat yourself. It could be that you want to buy for a birthday or you want to buy for an anniversary. It could be that one of these albums had a song on that was your first dance at a wedding or maybe a parent's wedding. So again, what a wonderful anniversary gift uh, that this can make. But yeah, I love it. The Rolling Stones and Sticky Fingers. You might be, um, you might be gathering collections of through the decades, actually. You know, you might be a massive fan of the 70s. You might be a massive fan of the 80s. You might just be, you know, all of your memorabilia and your collectibles, you know, it go, can go from key rings to concert tickets to posters to whatever it might be. Um, again, this might just be slotting in really, really nicely to your collection right now. So the item number for the Rolling Stone Sticky Fingers is 2330. <laughs> uh, the price are 199.99. Remember, that's free postage and packing. That represents a big, big saving or ready for you for something that is very very limited edition remember uh, when that limited edition has gone it's gone everyone is completely and utterly unique to you in their limited edition as well and remember you can spread the cost of that as well interest free i'm loving this show i'm sure you are as well um and behind me behind me I is uh it's someone that i think we always have in our hearts mm -hmm. And, and, and actually, the, the career of Whitney Houston, and of course her story is well documented um, as well, but because she had so many iconic hits, because she has such a story, everyone has that connection with her music one way or the other. Yeah, I mean, for me, 
the bodyguard the film absolutely was just amazing with kevin costner yep. and on this album is um the greatest love of all which after my sister and i have had a couple of tipples that is our go-to karaoke song together <laughs> which is just amazing she was just incredible now this one the greatest hits was released in may 2000 of course after she passed away in 2012 there was kind of this massive resurgence in sales and it actually re-entered the album charts as well in so many different countries around the world and you can understand it you know what I mean yeah. I can't imagine many people do not know a few words to a song when it comes to oh, Whitney yeah There's, absolutely everybody must know it and almost irrelevant of your age as well because I think yeah. even even you know even youngsters now will definitely you just hear the first few bars of I want to dance with somebody and yes everyone instantly ah oh, brilliant yeah, yeah. Dance. You know, straight you up know, don't on you? the dance floor you've got multi-platinum uh, so many different platinum awards for this album saving all my love for you was on there one moment in time i have nothing which of course is from body card you know what i might actually watch that again i will always love you run to you that was all on there too an absolute legend and i don't think anybody would disagree with that so this is a limited edition it's framed it's mounted as well. This is the gold dish. You've got the album cover there as well. And it's Whitney Houston's greatest hits. And I have to say, this is definitely one that would be at the top of my list to be able to have. Oh, and yeah, no, absolutely. Um, because, you know, with Whitney, it's all about those iconic songs. But mm. it's about the, you know, the, the films. It's about her story. It's about... I think we all have a great love and affection for Whitney Houston, for you sure, know, yeah. because we, I guess we've all, because her life was very, very well documented. So you know all about her happy and uplifting music and whatever. And in the back of your mind, I guess we all have her story and, you know, and what happened to her as well. And life takes us all in different directions. Um, but I think we all have a place in our heart uh, for Whitney as well. And you might be a huge Whitney fan. Well, again, here is your chance to have that little bit of collectible magic from your favourite musical icons. Log on now to allstardiscs.tv to grab yourself a piece of authentic music memorabilia. For that special on-screen price, you'll receive an exclusive framed and mounted presentation display that will look fabulous in any home, office or business. Order today and you'll enjoy free UK P&P, saving $9.99. Plus, you can choose to spread the cost of your purchase over six interest-free payments. So, don't miss out. Each release is limited to only 150 pieces worldwide. And when they've gone, they've gone. Order yours now at allstardiscs.tv. Oh, thank so you so easy. much for being there. Mm. I mean, what a show. What a little wander down memory lane. And I think that's the kind of thing, that's the kind of gift that this is. It's not just purely about how beautifully decorative it is, how special it feels, how different it feels as well. It's far from, you know, an ordinary gift. It's really, really lovely. And again, it sparks up that conversation. Every time, you know, when people come back round to our houses and whatever and see that, that's a new conversation, mm. isn't it, about those legends? Yeah, and we've got lots of legends that you can choose from as well. Here's a few more for you. We've got Bob Dylan here, Blonde on Blonde, and it was a double album that he reduced, uh, reduced uh, that he released in 1966 with Columbia Records. The tracks include the likes of Rainy Day Women, you've got I Want You, Just Like a Woman, Visions of Johanna. You've got so many different songs on that album that a lot of people are going to love. And again, just that kind of gold disc, it's like the sun, like you say, you're going to walk in Completely. to any house, any room, and it's yeah. just going to, like a magnet to you, isn't it? Yeah. Then moving on, we've got Celine Dion. Again, she's up there with Whitney with me. I really, really think she is. This is the My Love Essential collection from 2008 with Columbia Records. But before this album, she'd already sold over 200 million albums worldwide. I wonder how that feels. I can't kind of comprehend that number, can no. you? No, and I'm sure they can't either when it happens. Oh, you've got The Power of Love, My Heart Will Go On, Titanic, the film, of course, oh, amazing, yeah. because you loved me. I mean, I could really do a karaoke on a few of those. <laughs> and there's also John oh, Lennon gosh. for you with Imagine. What a lovely album cover that is. I love that. Um, this was produced not just um, by John, but his wife, Yoko Ono, of course, uh, was on there, which is great. Uh, it was her birthday recently, actually, in February. Above um, us, only sky. Beautiful. And I'm a cloud lover, that little cloud there. Uh, again, 
amazing, amazing album and a little snippet of history for you uh, from one of the Beatles, of course. Ah, oh, awesome. And there's a massive, massive collection um, on our website. So make sure you go and have a little look around allstardiscs.tv. Remember, you can spread the cost of these amazing items interest free. They're all very, very highly collectible because they are limited edition as well. Um, please do enjoy this. It really is a heartfelt gift. And you see the memories that we've been sharing just half an hour. There's so much to discover. See you soon.